Hey everybody, what's going on? Your host, Lovely Cheese Pizza here. I am seriously burning to death right now. Not like I'm sitting in a in like a pool of fire or anything, but I feel like I'm burning to death right now. It is so hot in this room, but I just found out that it is pouring down rain outside and it's cold and I feel amazing now. <laughs> or at least I, I will by the end of this video. That is good news. Welcome back. Let's play some more Doom 2. I'm going to take a quick break real quick and get another handful of nerds. It's like my cocaine at this point. Not like I really know what cocaine is like. But if there's one thing that we know is that cocaine is one hell of a drug, as, as a certain man would have said. So... Last time, we got caught in a really weird place in the chasm, where I couldn't figure out where to go. And I'll tell you, <laughs> I, I consulted a walkthrough to figure out where to go. The answer was right here, the whole time. There's portals right there. I feel so stupid. <laughs> I feel... I feel like a, uh... I feel like a perfect arse. Where the hell is he? Oh, there he is. There's a lot going on right now. I don't know where it's all coming from. We, we, we good here? Or are we, uh, all, right, all right, we're going to go around here. So yeah, that was that was really the only thing that we needed this entire fucking time. And then we'll get the red key here in a moment. Which I... Th White's good. Yep, that's the one. Okay. Yeah! All of that, dude. I, I did all of that aimless wandering around like a buffoon. Like a fucking buffoon. And all I had to do was come right here in the old blue room. This this room had to have been made by Eiffel 65. There is no there's there's no other possible creator of this room than Eiffel 65. I mean, they they are at the very least blue dubba dee dubba die. I mean, if they were green, they probably would die. And that would be a that would be a pretty bad it'd be a pretty bad moment for for really anybody if they found out that the only way that the only thing that could till that could kill them, or Emmett till them, I suppose, which is terrible to say. <laughs> that is awful. Um, the only thing that could kill them, in a sense, would be um, if they if they were invaded by green, and that's that's kind of what happened there. Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! Oh jeez! Okay, enough with the up and down madness. This is this is not the fucking the the ride at the fair where you sit in the chair and it just goes at different oscillating levels of up and down. <laughs> this, this is not that. I already had my nightmare story with that. I, I told it a really long time ago. I'm pretty sure, but I will tell it again, um, just for the sake of it. But I at the fair, I think it's called like I think it was called Sinbad actually, which always made me laugh because I didn't realize that that there was a different Sinbad other than the comedian, and so I thought that that ride was actually named after him. <laughs> Which is a really funny thought to think of now, because that's totally not the case that they're getting at whatsoever. But that's not the point. Hey, we're done with the level! Thank God! I don't have to deal with that anymore, but I remember I got on that ride, and they put the harness over you and all that stuff, and they were in a hurry to get everybody going, because there were people that were taking forever. I was on the far, I was on the far edge, so I was the last person that they were doing that for. And they put the harness on, and the person kind of haphazardly did it and kind of ran off to go control the thing. What level is this? Blood Falls? Oh, I remember Blood Falls, kind of, sort of. Just seeing all those weird ritual candles kind of brought it all back to life for me there. But we'll go on down to the Blood Falls. Ah! Oh jeez! Oh jeez! Oh jeez, man! Oh jeez, man! Oh god! I've 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 done it now. Oh, I wasn't supposed to do what I'm doing. <laughs> I wasn't supposed to do it this way. <laughs> oh no! Ah! <laughs> oh god! Okay. Oh, well, I didn't go over very well at all. I probably shouldn't have gone that way. Maybe this way will be better. This uh, is that just a? Oh, I thought it was just, it looked like a poster of the guy, of the chain gun guy. <laughs> That's what it looked like. Um, but yeah, so the guy put the, he put the, the harness on really haphazardly, and uh, I ended up, I mean, he ended up starting the ride, and, uh, and like, it initially had felt like he did fine, like it wasn't really going to be a big deal or anything, until, oh, hey, until um, we started kind of going up and, and down and, and whatnot, um, God, stop it with all that! God, you and your 
barfing fiery skulls thing. Dude, take a take a peps at AC and call it a night, man. Jeez. Go see your demon doctor. If you if you continually vomit skulls for more than four consecutive hours, please come in and see us. For the love of God. Man, he took almost all my fucking health out of that. You jerk. Anywho, now that now that, that whole mess is done. So, um So the thing start the ride starts going up and down, and in the middle of that, I notice do um, I notice that my harness is like coming undone at the seams more or less and uh, I get to a point where that thing is no longer holding me up at all like the the, the thing at the harness my harness actually came up like it came off and what took my face off um, and so at that point oh, how do I get to that I do not know how to get to that is there is there a uh, some sort of key mechanism Shit. Okay, obviously not. How would I even get to that? Something tells me that we probably gotta go through... How did you guys get over here? It doesn't really matter. Uh, but yeah, I had to pretty much hold on to the bar for dear life. Because otherwise I probably would have fallen to my... Maybe not Maybe not my death. I guess it depends on, on what varying height I was at. Uh, at that moment. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh god. Okay. Alright. Revenant down. Revenant down! But I'm also about to be down. Jeez. Ah! There's something crawling on me! God. This is not the time. This is really not the time to have creepy crawlies all over my legs. Ah! My leg! Where are all these dudes coming from? Seriously. They're just coming out of the damn waterfalls. Don't go chasing waterfalls, especially when the waterfall is all bloody. Um, but yeah, and so, like, they eventually noticed uh, that I was pretty much dangling off of that fucking thing, and they ended up stopping the ride, and they were able to refasten the thing, and everybody got, like, it ended up turning into, like, one and a half rides for people. And we go in here, hey! Oh shit, we're gonna die, we're gonna die, we're gonna die! No, we're good. Okay, we're good. These levels are so hectic, man. Like, just every time you think, uh, every time you think you, you got kind of a grasp on, on the world, they, they throw you a curveball. Really bad. <laughs> okay. Alright. We, there we go. We're, we're good now. Let's go down here. At least build up our, our weaponry. So, yeah, that's, that's definitely that. A very, very interesting thing. And you know, I've got I've got something stuck in my head right now, and and I just I, maybe I just need to say it. maybe I just need to do the same protocol for songs that get stuck in your head and just say it. But I don't even know why it's in my head at all. It, it is such a it is such a minute thing. But I've been watching I, I, I watch a ton of Game Grumps like they're they're one of my favorite channels to follow. And I was watching I, I I had to end up go I had to go find the episode just because I had this one little thing stuck in my head all day today. It was, it was, uh, it was, I think they were playing Mega Man 3, and <laughs> Danny, Danny's just like, he signals over to Aaron, he's like, he's like, hey, hey, bring, bring, uh, bring the weapons menu back up again, and, uh, he brings it up, and, and he's, like, looking at the, the weapon things there, and he goes, Pihamato. <laughs> I don't know why it's funny to me. I don't know why I got a laugh out of that. I think it's just the way he says it. He was just like looking at the, like the abbreviations for like the weapon power-ups and whatnot. And he just goes, Pihamato. <laughs> it, it makes me laugh every time for realistically no particular reason at all. It, it, it And it's it's not even really that funny. I think it's just the fact of how he says it. it, it it's just like, I don't know. Like, it just, I don't know, resonated with my brain a certain way and it just makes me laugh. Probably because I do the same thing. Um, I just I have I, I will analyze things essentially the same uh, when I see something like that. So I don't know. I I, it, I got a good laugh out of it. And I had to get it out of my head because it was starting to drive me crazy. Oh! I should have used I should have used the BFG right there. Actually, that would have been the perfect spot to use that. I just uh, didn't think about it in time. <laughs> Fucking time. I've uh. I've been. I, I kind of touched on. I touched down on this just a little bit in my Dark Souls episode that I that I just got done filming not too long ago. But um, I've been. I've been over the last few days. I've been on like this kick 
of watching um, of watching speed runs of videos. I find them so interesting. I love watching speed runs, especially the ones that aren't tool assisted. I love watching the ones that are done just organically, without the use of of you know like tool based assi like assistance. Uh, like those those are still fun to watch too, but it's just you know using like quick save states and all these things. It kind of takes away from it a little bit for me, but. The ones that I've watched so far, at least, I, I watched a really good one that was. Oh god! Oh no! Oh no! Oh god! Okay, we're doing it! We're doing it again! Okay, that worked out pretty well, actually. Kind of wish I had had to burn that much, uh, you know. Um, Fucking uh, oh, we got it all back. Never mind. I was gonna say I wish we hadn't burnt so much uh, plasma ammo, but we got it all back, so it's fine. Um, the ones I've watched so far, I watched a link to the past one, which was great, and I just got done watching um, a uh, Donkey Kong Country 2 one, which was amazing. Like the the way that those guys did, or like that guy actually, the way that this this guy completed levels. And just doing, like, executing all these, like, frame-perfect jumps and rolls and all these special things. It was so much fun to watch. Fucking, I love that stuff. I want so badly to find a game... Oh, no! I want so badly to find a game that I can do that with. Uh, I just, I've never had a game that I excel at at such a level that I could get away with doing that. Um, so it's, it's kind of a bummer, really. I would love to be able to do that sort of thing. Where is he? Oh, I hate it. I wish I hadn't gotten stuck down here, because I know that... The second I... Oh! Oh! Jeez! Oh, God, I was really hoping to not have that happen. <laughs> it looks like, uh, it looks like the... kind. He looks kind of like the alien from, the, from Signs. Obviously, this came out before Signs. Maybe they modeled it after that. Who's to know? Um... Okay, so now now we at least know what we're supposed to do. We gotta go inside here. Oh no. Okay, this is this is good. Oh. Cool. Um, but yeah, dude, watching him do all those things and just complete the game with with such minimal deaths was so awesome. I just I really want so badly to find a game that I can that I can excel at and and have a run like that that I can do um, at you know, at a uh, really awesome event like, uh, you know, Games Done Quick. Because not only are people playing, you know, games like that and, and being amazing at it, but they're also raising a shitload of money for uh, for cancer research. And I think that is just the coolest shit. I mean, I've, I, I've, lost, I've lost family members to cancer. And it would be really cool for me to be able to do something like that. I just wish that there was a game that I knew I could uh, do something like that with to be able to... You know, be fucking awesome at it. Not to mention, I mean, shameless plug, but it, it would be it would be a really good thing for my channel, like just publicity-wise, to be able to get, um, you know, kind of expand my viewer base by having a bunch of new people watching. But that wouldn't be the reason why I would do it. I, I would want to do it just for my sole love of gaming and, and being able to have something like that that I could look back on and be like, man, I remember being able to play that, you know, to go to that event and and contribute to it and just be part of that whole experience. I think it would be so awesome. I just have no idea what I would do. I mean, there's, you, I mean, you can literally do that with with pretty much any game that exists. I mean, I've seen everything from uh, from you know Super Mario Brothers to Half Life uh, to like Halo to Call of Duty campaigns to Splatoon to Shovel Knight to any like every game that you could possibly imagine. What in the hell? Are you seeing like some weird like graphics clipping? It's weird. I, I've, I've seen like some textures just going totally bonkers over here. It's weird. Um, something tells me. God, we're so low on health right now. This is this is a real predicament. I have an idea though. We'll lower this. We'll go through here. Should be able to get through this part without taking any damage. Now that I say that, I'm probably going to take some. Um, we'll just have to see what happens. Oh god, that was close. That could have done some damage. Could have done some om- ah, No! God, the chain gunner! The chain! The plane, Tommy! The plane! Ah, oh, fuck. Man, this level, the blood falls, man. It, it is 
it is it is putting me through oh my god <laughs> oh boy that was uh lyrical suicide or no well, lyrical homicide not lyrical suicide that's <laughs> lyrical suicide is basically today's music is what that is it is verbal diarrhea that makes you want to take your own damn life that's pretty much all that is anymore all right Take out the chain gunners, take out the chain gunners, take out the chain gunners, or must take out the chain gunners. Wherever they may be, oh my god, this level is driving me insane. <laughs> I can't take it. I can't. I cannot Christian Hackenberg this level right now. We're going the wrong way, but that's fine. Yeah, really not where I wanted to be right now. It's not, not at all where I was planning on going. And now this is happening. That's just fantastic. Um... So yeah, the oh okay the uh, the the last game that I watched um, have the have the speed run done for it was uh, Kaizo Mario. Those games are fucking crazy, man. That is that is one of the most remarkable things um, is watching those like rearranged Mario things. I've seen I've seen like the Super Mario I've seen the Super Mario World ones like a do, like just a billion times, but I. For the first time tonight, I saw one that was... I finally saw one that was done for Mario 3, and... Like, for me, I feel like... I feel like Mario 3 is so much harder to do something like that, because... You know, that some of the mechanics are a lot more primitive. Um, and... There's no... I mean, it, it, I don't know, which... It, that, that statement can realistically go both ways. Um, because... You know, there are more intricate things that you can do... With, uh, with, like, the Super Mario World, you know, engine, as opposed to the Super Mario 3 one. But there are some mechanics in the Super Mario 3 engine that are way harder to execute than the ones in, uh, in Super Mario World. God, this is driving me crazy right now. They are, they're just everywhere. I can't, I can't, like, I can't isolate them away from one another to be able to pull this off. I really hope I can get up there. <laughs> really hope I can get up there. I don't know what that is. I keep running into it, and I keep it keeps stopping me in place. Okay, I'm gonna go up. I'm gonna take a chance, and I'm gonna go up. I just hope that I don't get killed I'm trying to get over here for health. Okay, we're fine. That was that was not looking good for a moment. On the plus side, I do know that there is that uh, there is that mega sphere. Um, in in the room with the blue key, so that will be good. That'll be fantastic. Uh, that's something I can look forward to when we get around to it. So let's go down. Um, but yeah, dude, those are crazy. I there just there are so uh, again so many things with frame perfect jumps, and there are just like a couple of moves that I I couldn't even like fathom how you know how that comes together. Like there's one there's one spot where he's where the guy's in a cave and he has to uh, he has to grab a star. He has to do a couple of like precision butt slides to get you know up on this platform to build up enough speed to make this jump over a giant pit like narrowly avoiding like the little chompy like flower things and then he has to take like this uh, perfectly necessary damage um, in order to uh, you know get across this gap it is just there's just so many things that happen in there that you're just like how how <laughs> just how oh no Oh no! I really, really, really need to get this thing. Thank you. I'm really thinking about using this right now. Totally gonna do it. Not gonna feel bad about it. That's uh, that's one way to do it. Not really, not exactly the way I was wanting to pull that off, but it's fine. <sighs> okay, we're looking good. We're, we're we're doing okay. This is definitely significantly better than where we were where we were sitting, um, you know, last time through this. We're we're looking pretty good right now. Um, we got a little. We got maybe like another minute or so that we can kind of uh, fool around with. But yeah, dude, speed run, super cool. I think if there were ever a game I'd want to do something like that with, maybe it would maybe be like one of the Max Payne games. I feel like I've played them enough to know. I would just I would just want to do it in a way that doesn't involve glitching. I, I would want to do it in just like a straight up, just really, really well executed run. You know, that's th those are the types of runs that I respect the most. Are just ones that um, it, it doesn't involve, you know, 
kind of cheating the game per se. It's just one straight up where you're just really, really good at it. You know exactly, you know how to time things and, and perform all the necessary tasks. Um, that's that's my jam. But again, totally different thing. Uh, what are we what are we looking at here? Moving along. Health's looking pretty good. You know what? This looks like a pretty good place to stop. I mean, it's uh, it's it's safe. It's one of the few places we've run into so far where there's not. It's not just littered with people. So, with that said, my friends, this is your host, Lovely Cheese Pizza, saying thank you guys for watching. When we come back, we are going to explore more of the Blood Falls. But for now, I'm gonna go make myself a turkey sandwich. So until then, I will see you guys next time. Bye, everybody.